Welcome to the Daily Guidance Meditation Podcast with the Realized Master. These meditation talks were recorded during intensive spiritual retreats with Sadhguru Siriyaji. Therefore, they might contain some specific teachings and wisdom for life to be taken into consideration. Each recording begins with a mantra to bring you into a favorable condition for the inner journey. This initial mantra is followed by a brief talk in which the process of meditation is explained to you. After the talk, keep meditating at least for 15 minutes and if you like it, continue, increasing the time by and by as you proceed. So now you are left with nothing else to do but close your eyes, relax, listen and let meditation happen. Satna 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 Satnam Radasu Ami Radasu So keep a relation then what we have to do is concentrating on the beautiful moments 
the beautiful events. The nice thing that happened. And just forget about the nasty things, the difficulties, problems, conflicts. So, in anything we do, we should try not to see the ugly part of it. Because in any happening of life, in any event, in, any, in anything, since we are in the world of duality, there is always a nice part and a bad part. So it's always important to be positive and concentrate on the nice things that happen. The same is about life. Life is a two-sided thing. There is always a positive side and a negative side. Eventually, these two sides are the same thing because the main purpose of existence is growth, its evolution. And we need to learn lessons, which we learn through nice events and what we may call bad events or uh, suffering problems. Because if the problems are there and we see the problems, it's because there, there is something inside of us that corresponds to them, that needs to be changed. So also, on this trip, this India, it's a mixture of nice things, nice sights, and maybe not so nice or bad sights. If you just focus on the unnice things, those we don't like, then we are going to miss the point. We are not going to see reality for what it is. Because there are also so many nice things. There is so much beauty also. And if you see both the sides, and especially we focus on the nice side of it, then, uh, then it's going to be nice. At the end of this trip we feel, uh, we feel very good. We feel there has been a very constructive experience, a very positive one, from which <coughs> we have been learning a lot and we have experienced a lot. So wherever we go, whatever we do, we should not see the bad side of it. We should try. It's okay, it's there. But we should always focus on the nice side of it. As I said, the same is the relations. In every relation there might be, might be a nice side. And there might be a bad side. Okay, we focus on the good side, the good things that happen. And we try to build on that and demolish the other side. Same thing is about spiritual practice. <coughs> spiritual practice is easy and maybe not easy. There are parts of it which might not be easy to take. <coughs> Maybe the body does not uh, find it easy because of the posture, because of 
this because of that because of sitting still because of tensions within ourselves because we are not used to sit still and moving and trying to control the mind but whenever there is a, an opening whenever there is some kind of a blessing and we are able to focus <coughs> to fully relax and the inner vision opens and we come in touch with the inner light or we come into a space of expansion and deep peace bliss or ecstasy then it's wonderful it's the most beautiful experience in life So when we sit in meditation, we should never sit with an attitude of uh, oh now I have to struggle somehow with my mind, with my body, and maybe suffer a bit. We shouldn't consider this. We shouldn't sit with this attitude. We should sit with this attitude of how oh nice I'm going to try to come in touch with the over self with the divine and trying to experience something higher than what I experience with the body with the mind and trying to come in touch with the spirit with the Holy Spirit of God and how great it is I'm doing the most important thing, the greatest thing we humans can do. So if you see like this, this already creates a beauty, creates a beautiful something beautiful atmosphere, a beautiful attitude which makes meditation very beautiful, very nice very special so with this attitude of love and devotion let's try to go through this meditation Let's try to relax as much as possible, to be at peace. If at some point you feel pain in the posture you are keeping, while keeping the focus at the third eye, you can move, change your position, it's okay. But try to keep doing the same and keep the focus. So let's still the body, let's still the mind. Let's try to avoid thinking of any useless thing. And anything is useless in this. In this situation, let's focus our surat in the middle of the forehead. Let's keep steadily looking <coughs> in the center. Let's keep calling on him by repeating the whole names. And let's pray to the infinite supreme being that in his infinite mercy 
He may bless us.